Hello. So this is my new red tuxedo urchin. I haven't seen one of these things at my local fish store in over a year. So as soon as they got one in, I made sure to grab it. I've been looking for one for about that long. And uh, so I'm really happy to have this guy. You don't see these quite as often as you see the blue ones, at least at this point in time. And uh, this guy is much smaller than my current blue tuxedo urchin. And so I've got two of them now. I've got the red here and then I've got the blue. And uh, if you'll notice and compare the difference between the two, the spines on the standard blue tuxedo urchin are a white gray, whereas these are more of a maroon color. You can really see that reddish color as it gets in under the light there. They have that same blue interior, but it is nice to have that sort of different diversity in color there. I have been really happy with my blue tuxedo urchin. Has done a great job at algae control in my tank. And with the corals I have in there, he really doesn't bother much. So I've been getting a lot of extra algae buildup lately and tired of going through snails and cleanup crew with my wrasse and coral beauty. So these guys don't get messed with <laughs> from the fish. They don't care for those pokey spines at all. So I went ahead and grabbed another one. And to be able to grab a red one was a real big bonus for me. So anyways, this guy is a lot smaller. He is about the size of a quarter. So he is uh, probably about between a half and a third of the size of the blue tuxedo urchin that I've had for almost two years now. So anyways, this guy, um, I'm hoping that he will help out with algae control and as well just add a cool additional color to the tank. I like having that additional color diversity there with the more reddish spines. And I'd be curious to see how he grows and develops. And that's all I've got and thanks for watching.